Hello, 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 Gordon Gecko here, bringing you episode number 60 already. Yeah, that's true, number 60 of my good old England save with the Tomb of Millbrook. Um, we are for the third season in the Vanarama Va National League South, so sixth year of British football. Um, during the, um, the preseason, I got an offer from Turkey uh, to join them in the League 2. So fourth tier, but I just decided to keep on this one, despite despite the differences that we have with uh, with the board at the moment in terms of salaries and all that. Uh, so this will be the third season that we start here. You can see last season how bad it was, and this season we're already going into the same direction. Look at this. And, well, let's see. Uh, I'm spending a bit less than last year. Last year I was spending around 30k in salaries. This year I'm only spending around 28. So just a 752 difference. So everything pretty much uh, controlled in that side. Um, in terms of the club, still insecure. Media prediction, 18th place. So not that different from last year. Last year I think we were uh, 19th, I think. So not not much different. Uh, in terms of um, transfers, well, a lot of people went out. Uh, this was well, this was due to the fact that a lot of youngsters were moving out. Also, one or two key players, not key players, but players that would play like Will Day, for example. He went out, defended right, um, and at the moment we only have five new entries. Um, I'm still looking for a striker and a defender right, but at the moment these are the ones that we count on. So from Merrill T came a uh, defensive midfielder. Uh, he plays defender center and midfielder center. And these were two positions we were looking for. John Rogers, Shekel McCartney um, from midfielder center. Uh, pretty good. Play, played for. Was in Plymouth. Uh, hasn't played nothing. Josh Bird returns. Again, he was with us last season. Played uh, 34 games. He was a good goalkeeper. He returns on the loan from Cardiff. From Portsmouth, also on the loan. A defender center. Um, well, he's in Portsmouth, hasn't played uh, last season for them. And f the last one at the moment is a midfielder or left, or I'm playing with him as a midfielder left. Uh, Stephen Oldring, also from a good team from Exeter, hasn't played any game for them, but let's see what he can do here. Like I said, I'm still looking to loan uh, a striker, and I'm also looking for... But you see how bad the strikers are. Look at this ability. I'm scouting like everyone that I can. Um, it's probably the best one. Charlie Hughes from also from Portsmouth. Okay. Um, let's let leave that for a moment. So training wise, I haven't actually touched here. Let's nothing here to adjust. I kept the same stuff. To be honest, we don't need. Any difference? We're already the best team in terms of staff. Facilities continue to be the worst ones, like basic use facilities, poor training facilities. Um, I'm kind of afraid that the club goes into administration again. Let's see if this doesn't happen this season. But if it's not happening this season, it'll happen next one. In terms of friendlies, a very, actually, very nice uh, preseason. First, we won against the under 18s, uh, then we lost against Swansea. At home, but of course, one see a team that is playing at the moment in. Uh, are they playing in the Premiership? No, in the, in the second tier. Uh, so, a normal defeat. Then Buckland 2 0, Brexton 5 1, and Art is 4 2 in testimonials. So, they will play Lemington. So, what, what does the board expect from us? Uh, avoid relegation once again. Um, so. Yeah, um, the FA Cup reached the third qualifying round, 
and reaches the qualifying round in the FA Trophy. So exactly the same objectives as last year. Before we go into the game, let's just see what the season preview tells us. So 18th place here, 101. We're actually playing today against Leamington. And if we're going to... I mean, I want to achieve a place here this season. Like between 8th and 13th or 12th. So around this area, that would be a su successful season for me. Anything over would be amazing. Anything down would be kind of a letdown. And if we get relegated, then that's even worse. But uh, against Leamington, uh, I'm expecting here the team will do at least okay, if not well. And we also play home, so... Right there, we are playing with all our loaned players, and these are the, to be honest, the best, um, the best uh, signings that we have are the players on the loan. With the reputation that the club has at the moment, I'm finding it very hard to get anyone better than the players that we have at the moment, and this seems obvious from uh, the scouts I can hardly find or the, the scouts do hardly find players that are above the um, two stars in terms of um, quality at the moment comparing to our squad so this gives us a pretty good understanding Just answering the text here. So nothing much happening. One, two, even game. Opportunity there, Williams. All in all, we had, to be honest, we had some, some, we have already some veterans in the team. Um, Williams is for sure one of them. Also Elijah, Ward, Musa. They have been with us for at least four or five seasons or more. I think Williams more, I think more, like six, seven. Uh, and Harris, nice one. Puts the first one in. That's a good start. That is really a good start. Since they shot this first two strikes, Leamington in the beginning. Well, now they have a third one, but they went uh, a lot of time without actually scoring anything, which is good for us. Now a corner lane, Ugh, Kennedy. There. But Williams is not playing superbly well. Uh, at some point in times, so Williams is also not getting any younger. Uh, the problem is, it's very hard to find um, strikers the f the type of quality like Harris, for example. And I'm really surprised that Harris is still. That looked like a foul. That Harris is still in our squad because he probably can play and. Um, other kinds of, and th there's a nice shot again from him. Nice goalkeeper defense. But he could probably play in higher divisions or would have a market for higher divisions. Not gonna do anything right now, but in a bit, Williams will come out. So we've been largely dominating in this game. This, I hope this will be the tendency this season, at least in the home games, that we kind of take advantage of uh, playing in a bad pitch, small pitch, and um, 
Liverpool managed to win the games. Hopefully, after such uh, stats with a bit more different, like Eason's coming in. Um, uh, okay, I'm going to put McCarthy in for Ward. Now for Elijah. Yeah. And I'll leave the last substitute if needed to. Or going again into the 75th minute or something. Okay, so one nil. I mean, with this stats, like thirteen shots to three, also fifty-six percent possession. I was hoping at the moment that that would have a bigger difference, but well, it is what it is. Kennedy's looking nervous, so I'm just substituting him. Take control of the game. Some players seem already a bit exhausted. I see that Lamington shot twice in this last few minutes, three times. Uh, fuck. Four times. I don't want to be caught here. And, uh... Okay, so it's over. We win 1 0. But to be honest, with these stats, uh, I think that we could have gone a bit better. Some here look frustrated. But okay, it was the first game of the season. Um, a lot still to come. Um, and like like normally, I will do a new update. So video number 61 will actually be um, when one third of the season is gone. And... Uh, that it is. So I'll, I'll just check which one that will be. Just I uh, hope it's like an interesting one. Let's get here to the league table. So 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, Wimbledon is this year in our division. Actually, let's, let's check this. Uh, so it will be probably going to do this against Basingstone at home. Or Shelms Ford. Just <coughs> before ending the video, let's. Uh, I mean, we didn't check this, or I saw, but. Okay, so. Wimbledon is actually last year, 201 to no. Strange. All the shot, Burgess Hill, Maidenstone, Brimley, these are the four big candidates. Dover, Verwood, and Valnardians. These are the other ones. Okay, so that was all for this video today. Thank you so much once again for watching. This was Gordon Gecko. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time. Bye-bye.